Hey guys, Alex here from Josh AI. I've got my home here outfitted with a bunch of different technology. Let me show you some stuff that we can do. Hey guys, so I want to show you using this Nano here um, to get us some commands using the new GPT-4.0. For reference on size, uh, here's some keys, so it gives you an idea of just how small this little thing is. Um, this is meant to be installed in a wall, so that's what that little clip is for. Just a little bit kind of sits right out. And then it's going to speak through this um, Sonos speaker. So we'll just kind of get started. A simple command. Let's do maybe, um, hey, Josh, in less than three sentences, who is Sam Altman? Sam Altman is an entrepreneur and investor known for co-founding and leading OpenAI and serving as the president of Y Combinator. He's influential in the tech world for his contributions to AI research and startup incubation. Think of him as a major tech trailblazer. So it's got all of that working. You'll notice it doesn't yet have the GPT-40 voices. That's not released yet, but once that's released, we definitely plan on using it. Um, in the meantime, this is a multimodal system. So in addition to getting GPT-4 uh, GPT commands, um, we can also use it for doing all sorts of devices. So for example, I can say maybe, um, hey, Josh, turn off the lights and close the shades. Got it. Living room lights are now off. Closing the shades. So we've got all these different lights here going off. And then we've got the shades closing. So we can ask it devices, we can ask it GPT things. But another one that we just did is we can also switch over to the app and show you some way to use some visuals. So for example, we can say something like, hey Josh, generate a photo of a music scene that's very colorful. generating your image. This may take 10 to 20 seconds. So in this case, this is gonna start generating the image. Um, we'll show you here on the phone. And um, yeah, it just takes your prompt and it's you know similar to using Dolly, which is now built right into ChatGPT. And so we can generate an image, get it over on the app, and then I can use that for making the app you know, look better if I wanna use it for a room photo, a scene photo. Illustrate an energetic music concert in a diverse spectrum of colors. Feature a bright stage bathed in multicolored lights, casting vibrant hues on the performers and audience alike. The band, consisting of a South Asian female guitarist, a Caucasian male drummer, and a black female singer should be energetically performing. Show a crowd of people of different descents and genders, dancing and enjoying the music with radiant expressions. Let the whole scene glow with the vibrant, pulsating rhythm of the music. Cool, so describes that image for me. We've got that created. So the next thing I wanna show you is what we can do when it comes to the vision side of GPT-40. On this building, we don't have any cameras, so I'm gonna switch over to a different building, um, this one that we call the Josh Lounge. And over here, we've got some cameras. So if I were in this room, I can simply give a hands-free voice command like we've been doing, but in this case, I'll use the app. And so what I can do is give this command, analyze the demo room camera. So it's analyzing the camera that we have in that room, and it's going to use vision to give us a description. So the image shows a modern living room with large windows offering clear view of a cityscape with high-rise buildings. Inside the room, there's a gray sofa, tripod floor lamp, wall-mounted TV, wooden console table with decorative items. And so we can tap to see that image. Um, but that whole idea is that we can very easily get that description of what's going on in that camera um, hands-free, just using AI. Of course, we can always control music and video and all sorts of stuff. So why don't I ask for a recommendation and then let's make it happen. Hey, Josh, what's a musical artist I might like if I'm into science and technology? If you're into science, you might enjoy the music of They Might Be Giants. They have a knack for witty, scientifically inclined lyrics that make learning fun and musical. All right. Plus, their eclectic oh. style spans various genres, so you're likely to find something you enjoy. Cool. All right, let's go for it. Hey, Josh, turn on the lights, open the shades, and play They Might Be Giants.
Got it. Living room lights are now on, opening the shades, now playing They Might Be Giants. Hey Josh, make the music a lot louder. <laughs> 